，各位誒、嗯、福音宣誒、呃、教會嘅弟兄姊妹早晨。Good morning, brother and sister at、uh, Brampton Evangelical Missionary Church. 誒、呃，實在好耐冇見啦。So for sure, you know, it's been a long time, you know, since we last met. 所以咧喺我未宣講神自己嘅説話之前咧，我想誒、呃、向大家先嚟問安。So I want to send greetings to you before you know I start ministering to all of you this morning. 誒，如果咧喺在座或者喺網上有新朋友咧喺呢度，我都想同你先打個招呼。So if you are in uh the current uh congregation currently, or you're worshiping online, I just want to uh say hello, like you know, to you. 誒，我想咧係用嗯啊。约翰三书二节咧，呢一节经文咧，向大家问安。So I'm going to reference like the Bible, like you know John chapter,、uh, the third book of John chapter,、uh, verse two. There's no chapter in Third John. Right. So、uh, it's verse two. Yeah, to greet,、uh, send greetings to you. 好 tricky 噶，约翰二书三书系冇第一章嘅。<laughs> 系冇章节，系得一章嘅啫。So it's only yeah for John, right? You know, there's only one like a chapter. So it's verse two in that chapter that I would like to send greetings to you with. 呢度咁样讲，佢话亲爱的兄弟啊，我愿意思即系祈求啦。你凡事兴盛，身体健壮，正如你的灵魂兴盛一样。So as the Bible says, "Beloved, I pray that in all respects you may prosper and be in good health, just as your soul prospers." 誒呢一句問我係咪好貼切咧 ？Do you think that you know this is a totally appropriate greetings to you all? 我諗你嘅眼睛咧係發亮咧，係喺邊一度咧？身體健壯啊 ！So perhaps you know your eyes just light up, yeah. Particularly, you know the the phrase. Saying, you know, in good health. 喺疫情当中，身体健壮真系好重要噶。Certainly during the pandemic, you know, being physically healthy is truly significant. 不过咧，你唔好忘记咧，呢一句嘅说话咧系后边嗰一句先至精彩。正如你的灵魂兴盛一样。So, but just as significant, even more powerful would be the following phrase. In good health, just as your soul prospers. 就好似咧，我哋照镜咧，嗰个真人啦，诶，系反映喺镜嘅影像。Just as you know, for example, we look into the mirror, like the true person's reflection, like you know, comes through the mirror. 咁喺呢一句嘅问安咧，真人系边一句咧 ？So certainly here, you know, it's a greeting. So who is that real kind of person? 就係、是、你嘅靈魂興盛，你嘅靈性活躍、活潑、有力。So it means that you know your soul prospers spiritually, you are active and alive. 原來咧，當人靈性好同神關係好嘅時候咧，你嘅身體啦，你嗰個嘅情緒都非常好嘅。So apparently, if spiritually, you know, you are healthy, it's posturing. That your relationship with God is vibrant, then physically, you know, you you also prospers. So, I hope that the church members, the brothers and sisters, your spiritual health is vibrant, your physical health is also vibrant. So, certainly, you know, my greetings, my wish for each one of you at Evangelical Missionary Church that your soul prospers, just as your health also prospers. 我哋讲翻今日嘅讲题啦，因为疫情嘅缘故咧，带出嚟啦，俾我哋啦喺生活上边有好多新常态嘅。Certainly, you know, because of the pandemic and how it has brought along lots of new normal, like for us. 唔知你能唔能够接受呢啲嘅新常态咧 ？I'm not so sure whether you've been able to manage and deal with all these new normals. 有好多人咧，都好希望咧，快啲，尽快咧，翻翻去以前嗰个嘅生活啊。Lots of people、uh, wish, you know, and anticipate that they could quickly return to how life, you know, was used to be. 
。誒，實在咧，疫情咧係令到我哋而家嘅生活日子咧已經唔再一樣啦。Certainly, you know, the pandemic, you know, has、uh, shifted, you know, how we are living like today. 嗱，今日咧，我咧就誒定咗一個講題咧，我覺得呢個講題咧係能夠。可以打開話匣嘅題目嚟嘅。Certainly, I've set a sermon topic that can certainly help us to,、uh, you know, open up like you know our conversations. 疫情給我們透視的人生路。So what does the pandemic tell us about life? 一個好好打開話匣嘅題目，因為人人都有話説。Certainly, you know, such a great topic, you know, to, as a conversation opener because everybody can speak to it. 如果我想請你咧諗下呢一個嘅題目嘅時候咧，即時出現喺你嘅腦海會係啲乜嘢咧 ？If I were to ask you, you know, to think about these questions and what would quickly like come to mind right now? 可能咧會有人講，我、哦、平靜如常嘅生活就係一個蒙福嘅生活啦。So somebody might share with you, you know, hey, you know, I have a, a, a trouble-free, a calm life, you know. So, so that, yeah, that is my life right now. 有冇人覺得係噶？舉一手啊！平靜嘅生活，如常嘅生活就係一個蒙福嘅生活。So a calm and、uh, ordinary living、uh, would be my life. 當你咧經驗過身體唔舒服啦。誒生活上邊有好大嘅轉變咧，你就覺得如常嘅生活係一個好無福嘅生活。So when you had experienced illness or symptoms and you struggle with it, then having a usual like normal life, you know, would be so hard to get it. 講到呢個題目，有人咧又會覺得咧係原來咧人生唔係日日如常噶，係有起有落，有高有低嘅。So some others might think, oh well, life is not necessarily everyday calm and normal. You know, life you know has its ups and downs. 人生咧固然咧係有一啲突發嘅事情出現嘅。Certainly, for sure, we know that life certainly had、uh, its unexpected、uh, occurrences that pops 甚至，甚至咧，冇人咧能够知道点解 why 同埋点样 how 佢会发生嘅。Sometimes things happen, you know, with you know, out of our prediction. We don't even know why it happened or you know how it happened. 无论咧人有几努力，有几多知识学问，你都揾唔到答案嘅。And even you work really hard, or you have lots of knowledge, that is hard, you know, for us to find answers to this. 新冠肺炎就係一個好好嘅例子啦。Apparently, the coronavirus, you know, is、uh, such a great example. 原來咧，人生嘅日子咧，絕對咧唔係掌控喺誒你自己手中嘅。Certainly, you know, the days of our life, you know, they're not totally within our mastery or even our control. 嗱，雖然咁樣講，我哋又唔好太悲觀喎。Even how I said so, you know, please don't be too pessimistic. 因為實在咧，有唔少嘅事情係你係可以喺你自己嘅掌握當中嘅。Because for sure, you know, there are certain things that are fully still within your control. 例如乜嘢咧，就係勤手勤洗手啦，戴口罩啦，保持社交距離咧，你就可以感染少啲嘅。So certainly, if you don't want to、um, uh, COVID transmission, then you know you should do more hand washing, wear your mask, and keeping your social distancing. 嗱，你要記住喎，係保持社交距離，唔係代表唔社交喎。Certainly, keeping a social distance、uh, doesn't mean that you dropped out of like you know socialization. 嗱，聖經裏邊咧有一類嘅文學題材咧 ，genre 咧叫做智慧文學嘅。Within the Bible, you know, there are a, a certain genre, you know, that's called wisdom lit literature. 嗱，顧名思義咧，誒，智慧文學就係教導人咧係有智慧嘅。So in other words,、uh, wisdom literature, meaning that you know it's scripture or A literature that teaches us people about wisdom. 誒，教我哋用智慧去過人生嘅日子啊。And by wisdom that we live our lives. 
你知唔知圣经里边边三卷书咧系属于智慧文学嘅咧 ？Do you know there are three books, you know, within、uh, the Bible that are titled, you know, as like wisdom literature？ 大家想唔想试下答下？ Do you want to try? You know, try to answer. Make a guess. Aya, make a guess. Eh, 传道书好叻啊！我哋读今日读咗好多传道书啊，传道书系其中一本。Excellent. So, yeah, the book of Ecclesiastes. Yes, we read from it earlier. 系啊，我听到有人讲箴言同埋约伯记啊。And certainly, I also heard Proverbs and Job. 就系、是、呢三本咧，系智慧文学啦。So these three books, you know, are a reference, you know, as wisdom literature. 圣经嘅智慧文学咧，话俾我哋听，人生有三类嘅日子嘅。Certainly, you know, from the wisdom literature in the Bible, you know, there are typically three types of like days of our lives. 嗱，第一类系咩日子咧？就系一个平常嘅日子啦 ，as usual. So the first type of like living days would be considered as usual or normal. As normal, as usual as normal. 系系平常，我哋又可以话咧系一个平静嘅日子。正如咧，你问人咧，你几好嘛？咁啲人话 good， 但系你再问佢有几 good 咧，你佢讲唔出，就系因为平静一啲咯。So we could say this type of like days we call it calm.、Uh, for example, like you know, you ask people how they're doing, they would say good, but they're unable to really. Explain like how good you know it was, you know, because it was calm, it was level. 嗱，平静啦，同埋平常嘅日子好重要噶，因为人嘅日子唔可以咧常常受好大嘅刺激。当你受好大刺激嘅时候咧，人会失常噶，人失去咗。So it's important like to have calm, like days, ordinary days, as usual, normal days. Otherwise, you know, we'll become so stimulated that you know sometimes our mind, you know, may kind of like come out of control. Now, 第二类嘅日子咧，就啱啱系平常嘅相反啦。So the second type of like days, you know, would be exactly the opposite of the first one, the calm days. 就系反常咯。So these are called unusual or abnormal days. 啊，咁咧第三类嘅日子咧，就刚刚系喺平常同反常嘅中间。So the third type of days, you know, would be kind of in between the first two. There are no usual. 咁就系咩咧？咁就系无常啦。So these are no usual, like you know, changing dates. 系啊，冇冇所谓咧，所谓。正常平常噶，系 keep changing 嘅。So you know, someone may consider, you know, well, you know, things are changing, you know, so you take it, you know, there's no usual. 但潮流兴咧用咧，诶，唔好咁多文字啦，会用 emoji 表情符号。And as you know, like the trend now is not to use as many words, but to use emoji to represent these things. 你你俾咩嘢 emoji 平常啊？請問 ，so what kind, what 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 will be the emoji that you would give it to like usual normal days？ 非常好啊 ，Fanny 做咗咁樣啦。So thanks to Fanny, you know, just like you know, with a hand gesture。如果你我教緊兒童主日學咧，我一定叫你啦，好似阿 Fanny 咁樣用動作嚟做嗰個表情。If I'm teaching children Sunday school, I probably, you know, would ask Fanny, you know, to kind of like do that hand gesture to show, like this concept, as usual as normal. 我本来咧都系谂嘅 Fanny 嗰一个，但系咧我用呢一个。But、uh, I was thinking earlier of Fanny's, you know, gesture. But right now, you know, I have like you know put this in, you know, as my emoji for its usual normal days. 经过咁长嘅疫症咧，我觉得咧平常嘅日子真系好开心嘅日子嚟噶。Certainly after such a long like pandemic kind of like you know shut down, you know, so yeah, having usual normal days, it's calm days, it's excellent. 咁反常咧，你会用咩 emoji 咧
So, you know, what emoji, you know, would you uh, link, you know, with this? Oh, I had a whole child, I got fans, I was on some bullet, you know, like I get saying, I like it, or I get fans, and some of them. So, being unusual, abnormal, as you see, you know, oh, you know, it's so sad and so painful. A lot of people during the pandemic, that's how they feel. So the no usual, the changing days, we probably, you know, carry this puzzling, you know, face because it's almost like constantly we have to uh, uh, problem solve, like to deal with the changing. 如果咧用天气咧嚟去表达呢三种嘅日子咧，我相信天朗气清咧就系诶平常嘅。哇，雷电交加嘅时候咧就系反常嘅，风云变色，明明上昼好好天嘅，一阵间就变咗咧系阴天嘅时候咧就会系无常。As you see, you know, from the picture, if we parallel it, you know, compared to weather, that maybe usual days would be like sunny. You know, days, bright skies, blue skies, unusual, abnormal days would be those thundering days, like, you know, coming in. And the, the changing days would be all of a sudden, you know, it could be sunny, but like, you know, it just changed, becomes cloudy and stormy. So for the pandemic days, you know, how do you qualify it? You know, what kind of days, you know, it has been? And I, for sure, you know, it won't be the, the calm, usual, normal days that we had experienced. So whether it's unusual, abnormal, or no usual changing days, so it probably all depends on, you know, what you had experienced during it. 实在咧，系喺疫症里边咧，有人咧唔单止失去咗工作，亦都失去咗家人，对佢哋嚟讲真系一个反常。So certainly, you know, for、uh, quite a number of people that they lost their jobs, or even they lost their family, their loved ones. So、uh, the pandemic days, they're really, you know, unusual and really abnormal for them. 如果咧你係一個學生咧，我相信 Covid 咧可能對你係一個無常，一時就要實體翻學，一時就上網。So let's say if you were a student, then perhaps you know it's it's changing days for you because sometimes you're in person at school or you're virtual learning, so it's changing every now and then. 我想問下咧，剛才講嗰三本嘅智慧文學，你覺得邊一本智慧文學咧係講緊平常嘅日子嘅咧？ So I'm going to ask you if you think back of the three books, you know,、uh, of the wisdom literature. What book, you know, would describe like calm, peaceful, normal days? Well, make another guess, huh? I'll, 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 So apparently, Proverbs, you know, is a book that really describes calm, normal, usual days. 反常咧，我相信一定系约伯记啦。约伯约伯一日之内，成个生，成个人生反转再反转。So perhaps Job, you know, would fit very well like to unusual, abnormal days because within one day, his life, you know, uh, got a completely turn around. 咁最後大家都知道，全部書咧就係講緊無常嘅日子啦。And as for the book of Ecclesiastes, you know, it certainly speaks to those no usual, those changing days. 嗱，傳道者咧嗰個智智慧咧，佢講虛空的虛空，虛空的虛空，凡事都係虛空，聽嚟好似好消極咁樣。Certainly, you know the、uh, the 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 offer of Ecclesiastes says meaningless, meaningless. Says the teacher, utterly meaningless. Everything is meaningless. It sounds so pessimistic, isn't it? 其实咧，刚刚相反啊，系智者咧，系将佢喺日光之下所观察到嘅事情咧，佢反映俾读者知道。Apparently, you know, it's not so. 
pessimistic. In fact, the teacher basically review, you know, what he observed, you know, day in and day out. So apparently meaningless, meaningless, meaning that under the sun, uh, with life circumstances, you know, we, we cannot predict ahead of time. We cannot even control it, you know, one way or the other. So later on, you know, I'm going to explain a little bit, you know, with the, the teacher, you know, a meaningless, you know, there certainly carries different definition. So basically the teacher just review, you know, what he has observed around him. So what has been will be again, what has been done will be done again. There's nothing new under the sun. So certainly the teacher, you know, did not just reference it once. In chapter 315, uh, he repeats it again. So perhaps to the wise teacher, you know, uh, yeah, what is the pandemic like anyhow? My son Definitely not something new. I recall like earlier on in the pandemic days and um, in the WhatsApp group, you know, I read of this. So apparently in the short video, actually, you know, uh, I read that in human history, roughly, you know, around like within a hundred years that, you know, uh, the humankind, you know, will face a, a, a special like virus. So COVID-19, so apparently to the vice teacher, COVID, well, even though, you know, he didn't live in the 21st century, like us, right? So he knew there's nothing new. So, you know, the teacher used meaningless. It carries many, many different uh, definitions. For example, meaningless means it's temporary. Or unknown. Or, you know, you're bewildered. Or it means something unimportant, something, you know, meaningless. Or something that even though you've done it, but it's futile, there's no profit to you. So certainly, you know, uh, when meaningless is used, it means chasing the wind. It's it's useless, futile. So how do you chase the wind? You know, it's it's not possible. Like it's it's not it's meaningless. <laughs> Certainly, uh, meaningless may mean like feeling empty. Uh, or, you know, something that is incomprehensible. Or even including something that is ab absurd or foolish. So, certainly, the wise teacher used. 38 times repeated, you know, in the Ecclesiastes. So it carries slightly different uh, meanings to it. Unlike, 
I think that the most appropriate description of it, you know, would be, you know, this particular picture. So certainly when you look at it, would that uh, remind you of like, you know, when you're cooking, then, you know, the steam coming from the pots. So meaningless, you know, represent breath or even like vapor. So don't underestimate vapor. So certainly when it comes, it could come quickly and it would, could come very intensely. So for those of us who wear glasses, you know, you know it like, you know, perfectly well in the winter time, you know, when you're coming from outside into the inside, you have to take off your glasses right away. So because you can see nothing that you have to take off your glasses, you have to kind of wipe it uh, in order for you to see. So vapor, you know, is so powerful because it makes you kind of like almost blind out because you can't see anything. Perhaps in a short while that you know you can't see it's it's relatively okay, but long term if you keep not seeing that it certainly you know will make you feel anxious and fearful. So have you ever, sorry, had that experience driving on the highway when it's thundering and uh, have, having high winds? If you're driving on the highway when it's pouring outside with high winds, even you turn on the wiper, you know, of your car, like the fastest mold, you can't really see what's in front. So when the vapor covers you and blocking your sight, that it certainly makes you feel very fearful and nervous. So when the vapor passes, then certainly now you can see clearly. So vapor comes, even though how intensely, how powerful, how... Um, kind of like dominating it is, but once it passes, you know, you'll be fine. So the wise ones teach us, you know, uh, meaninglessness like vapor, they come quickly, they come strong, they come intense, but once it passes, it's temporary. It will go away. Certainly compared to uh, the eternal God, like meaningless or vapor, uh, you know, they're, they're short, they're temporary. So so only a wise teacher, you know, taught us that we have to seize hold of God. Certainly, you know, we have to seize hold of our Lord because in many things in life, you know, we are unsure, you know, we don't know. Certainly, 
even though, you know, apparently in our daily living, there are many things, you know, that may happen to us, we, we're not aware of. In chapter 11 of Ecclesiastes, verse 5, the wise teacher said, As you do not know the path of the wind or how the body is formed in a mother's womb, so you cannot understand the work of God, the maker of all things. Certainly, we see newborn babies, parents are overjoyed, you know, they're touched and moved. And certainly, you know, how this baby who used to be a fetus, you know, how the fetus grew in the mother's womb, you know, we, we don't know how. So, by the way, you know, if there's just so many things that we don't know, what are we going to do about this? <laughs> or perhaps would we, you know, be liking many say, well, let it be, right? You know, you don't, since you don't know, like lay low. But quite the opposite, like the wise teachers, you know, taught us despite the unknown, you have to give your very best, you know, to do it. Ah, in verse 6, the teacher continued to say, So your seed in the morning, at, e at evening, let your hands not be idle, for you do not know which will succeed, whether this or that, or whether both will do equally well. So the teacher, you know, lived, you know, in a rural uh, kind of farming um, environment. So therefore, you know, giving uh, such a parallel of farming, you know, uh, to his teaching. So the teacher said, don't be lazy and don't like, you know, go the short ways, don't, no cheating, because you don't even know when you sow the seed, whether it's in the morning, in the evening, you know, how it will succeed and he will grow, it will grow. So even during the days when we uh, cannot master, you know, the, the, the future, but we have to work our very best to continue to do what we do. I also want to uh, give another example. So approximately about, you know, perhaps a year and a half, two years ago, like during the pandemic. So uh, a sister in Christ, you know, at a prayer meeting, she asked the group, you know, to pray for her. And apparently this sister, you know, uh, you know, uh, along with some members from the short term, you know, uh, mission team, they, they pray for this, um, action that every, uh, in the morning at around eight, they would go door to door to collect signature for the purpose of like opposing uh, the build of uh, a marijuana shop at Silver Star Boulevard. 
。咁呢位姊妹講嘅時候咧，大家個腦裏邊諗緊啲咩咧？哇，有冇可能啊？八點鐘個個都翻曬工啦，又或者咧喺疫情邊個開門俾你啊？再加上邊個會掂你支筆嚟去簽名啊？邊個咧會同你傾偈保持社交距離喎、啊？好多嘅問題。So certainly, when this sister, you know, brought up, you know, this project, and lots of people's reactions include, "Well, 8 a.m. Are you kidding? You know, people have to go to work, and、uh, would people like open their door for you? Would they take your pen to give their name? You know, how about like keeping social distancing? You know, all these kind of reasons. You know, it seems impossible to go ahead." 但係呢位姊妹講咗一句説話，我好記得。佢就話：做咗未必有成果，但係唔做就一定冇結果。So this particular sister, like you know, her comment was, you know, yeah, you know, I'm fully aware. Even if we do it, there might not be any outcomes. But if we don't do it whatsoever, then definitely, you know, there will be no outcome whatsoever. 佢就係講緊第十一章第六節呢一樣嘅事情。So apparently, she referenced chapter eleven in Ecclesiastes, chapter、uh, verse six, that despite the unknown, give and do your very best. 另外咧，喺无常多变嘅日子嘅当中咧，人咧系要唔单止尽力嘅尝试，仲要咧坚心嘅依靠神。Certainly, you know, during the unknown, when things are unpredictable. We, you know, not only that we have to continue to do, but we need to trust God wholeheartedly. 人喺疫情里边咧，难免都会抱怨咧，失去咗以前嘅生活。Certainly, during the pandemic, many of us, you know, we certainly did complain that the loss, you know, of the normal living that we once had. 但系咧，传道书有一句咁样嘅说话。But in Ecclesiastes. 第十節，不要説先前的日子強過如今的日子，是什麼緣故咧？因為你咁樣問就冇智慧咯。Certainly, you know, in the same book, chapter seven, verse ten, do not say why were the old days better than these, for it is not wise to ask such questions. 我覺得咧呢一句説話咧係可以咧係喺小組啦、團契啦攞嚟做誒辯論嘅題目嚟嘅。I trust that you know this question could be raised, you know, in our like small group、uh, gatherings and and fellowship and and ask everyone's response. 嗰個題目咧就係先前的日子強過如今的日子，正反兩方。Uh -huh. So the title could be, "Wow, you know,、uh, the old days better than these current days." 啊，你唔好擔心咧，你贏咗咁咪咪同出聖經唱反調咯。你唔使擔心呢樣嘢，因為咧，往往咧係辯論嘅結果咧，唔代表真理嘅。<笑> Certainly, even though if you win, like don't worry, because the outcome of the debate, you know, uh, can be way far, like from the truth. 我我哋常常都睇到咧，嗰啲誒總統啊、總理嘅選舉啊，辯論得贏咗嗰個都唔係最好人選嚟。<laughs> so when we know, we learn from history. Even all these presidents or, like you know, candidates for like you know, prime minister, you know, even they won the debate, but it doesn't mean that whatever they say, you know,、uh, would be the the whole truth. 誒，智慧人咧喺佢嘅人生嘅閲歷啊，佢係睇得多啊，所以咧喺佢觀察嘅誒呢一啲嘅日子裏邊咧，佢話咧後來啊。我哋經驗後來嘅日子咧，唔係冇價值嘅，唔係冇意義嘅。So the wise teacher, you know, perhaps have looked at like life circumstances, have been observing, and、uh, so the point is, right? You know, the days that are to come may not be worse, you know, than the days it used to be. 所以咧，唔好咁快講咧，而家啲日子冇以前咁好。So don't be too quick to say that you know our current, our present days are not as good, you know, as you know the old days. 喺喺疫情里边咧，我带过一个嘅实体退休会咧，我同弟兄姊妹玩咗一个咧类似 musical chair 嘅游戏。So、uh, during the pandemic, you know, I had led an an in person、uh, kind of like short retreat, and and there was you know this game, you know, I I I played with them. 
誒裏邊咧有一條題目咧，就係、是、疫情咧對你咧嘅影響係正面定反面？請舉例説明。So, so the question is, you know, how the pandemic, you know, has brought you positive or negative, you know, uh, experience, and then give an example to it. I think that there are many brothers and sisters who have been trying to solve the question. I just want to say one thing. I just want to say one thing. How many positive experiences have you had? So the the game, the exercise, eventually, you know, they always pick the same question and then and they talk nonstop. Believe it. So, 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 Ah, the wise teacher sure in chapter seven, verses eight to nine. The end of a matter is better than its beginning, and patience is better than pride. Do not be quickly provoked in the spirit. For anger resides in the lap of fools. 我我我谂到嘅例子就系龟兔赛跑啦。I could think of an example would be, you know, the hare and the turtle race. 我系一开始个个都觉得系只兔仔赢嘅，但系原来咧事情嘅终局先最重要噶。So at first, everybody believed, ah, yeah, you know, the the rabbit, you know, is going to win. Uh, so, uh, but how come? Like you know, the outcome totally shocked us. So I think so. It's not just about the outcome, but as to how the turtle won the race and how the rabbit lost the race. So therefore, you know, when we are unable to see the outcome uh, of the thing, the wise teacher taught us, you know, patience. It's important. So certainly, you know, everyday living, you know, we are always moving forward. You know, day in and day out, we are closer, you know, to the outcome of the days. Yeah, do you agree? So life is moving forward. So certainly next week we're gonna no longer have July 17. So I think that like living life forward, meaning you're swimming, huh? So, like you know, uh, the backstroke, huh? So you know, I had a kind of backstroke, like swimming in the backstroke style experience. So I remember, you know, during the like the the um uh, sometime in the pan pandemic, I took a vacation to Me Mexico, and uh, right in front of me, you know, there was this big swimming pool. So such a big, huge, like swimming pool. No one is swimming in it. <laughs> you know, um, Caucasians, they just like to lie on the beach, you know, have a cocktail in their hand, lying in the sand, and that's it. They are totally satisfied. <laughs> so excellent. You know, I had the entire pool like to myself. So I was enjoying the sun, you know, so I float in the water. <laughs> so um so you you gotta move like you know you can't float too long so I was just one stroke you know at a time slowly and kind of paddling on water 
去得好好啊，去得好快喎、啊，一下又去，兩下又去。原來咧，我都不知不覺咧，原來咧好快到到誒個、呃、泳池對對面啦。但係咧，我一手一盤，啲水一沖。So, so very quickly, you know, I didn't even realize one stroke at a time, quickly one, two, you know, I eventually got to, you know, the other end of the pool. So, and I was so carefree, I splashed and then I smashed my shell, myself, you know, onto the wall of the pool. So if I could draw you a picture, you know, my head basically hit the wall of the pool. And, uh, you know, so I was like, you know, um, uh, I don't know. <laughs> so having stars and moons in my head. And I felt dizzy. Yes. I, yeah, you got dizzy one, one day. <laughs> but... <laughs> But at the time, you know, I got to, I, I, I was so embarrassed. I just pretended nothing happened. So I quickly turned around and yeah, use breaststroke, like, you know, to uh, uh, swim away, you know, and, and get to the other end. So I swam towards, you know, my husband. So he asked quickly, you know, are you okay? <laughs> so I knew that he was reading a book and he apparently, you know, didn't watch me swimming. So 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 I was a bit puzzled. So I, I asked him. You didn't see me. <laughs> so, so he said, well, I didn't see you, but I heard a loud noise. And then probably, you know, people around, they all saw it. So actually some of the Caucasian, they even stopped by to make sure to see that you're okay. Ah, oh, I was so darn like you know um, embarrassed. So if you swim backstroke, certainly you know you don't feel secure. You know you don't feel safe. <laughs> so apparently, when you swim. Backstroke, you you can see the front, uh, because you are facing the front. Uh, you are facing the back. Sometimes you know we struggle like day in and day out with life, one day at a time, too busy. And we don't see, you know, what is in front of us. But like swimming backstroke, you know, we just have to face up and we look up like, you know, uh, to the above. So we look up like to God because only God, you know, knows of our life. So like, you know, one of the hymns we sing, you know, even though I don't know the future, you know, but I know God holds tomorrow. So I encourage you, you know, perhaps living like your life daily, you know, would be like swimming backstroke, you know, with your face, look up, look up to God. So unknown days, 
unpredictable days certainly you make us feel anxious and nervous fearful of what is to come so I'm not sure whether you have think of like even though these seemingly meaningless days these also are created by God himself so I found like, you know, these translation, chapter 7, verse 14, it says, When times are good, be happy, but when times are bad, consider this. God has made the one as well as the other. Therefore, no one can discover anything about their future. 原來呢,我哋簡簡單單呢,分我哋嘅日子呢,有順境嘅,有有逆境嘅,兩者都係上帝安排俾你。So perhaps if we can divide up our days, you know, uh some days are smooth, some time some days are aversive. But these are both made by God. 所以當我們話而家冇咁好啊,支持好啲呢,其實可能你未必知道上帝俾你嘅心意。So when we sometimes complain about well, you know, these days, current days are not as good as the old days, then perhaps, you know, you have not be mindful of like, you know, God's kind of like will. So God, you know, provided us with like two sets of days, the gay, the good days and the bad days. Because it is a call onto us that basically no one can discover and to know about their future. So when there's no usual, there are changing days. In fact, you know, it's a call from God that we have to come towards him and to uh, rely on him. 剛才說呢,疫情裡面改變了我們很多的生活的狀態。Just now I mentioned that uh, the pandemic certainly has uh, uh, changed, you know, affected many of our way, usual ways of living. 很多東西都被震動,經濟啦,人心啦,社會的結構啦,工作的模式啦,甚至教會的運作都被shaken. So, you know, the lots of things in our world, you know, got shaken up during the pandemic, like, you know, uh, our, 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 our weight of like relating to people, you know, our hearts and mind, our nature of our job and, uh, and social structure, you know, all these things, you know, have been uh, transformed. 我都不知道是不是應該用transform, <laughs> so I would say, you know, to qualify, you know, it's almost like all these things are shaken up, not even transformed. But there's, we trust, we know, you know, there's one unshakable God that we have. So certainly, you know, the teacher, you know, in the book of Ecclesiastes wanted to kind of like sum up, which is in chapter 12, verse 13. Like I had already shared with you, you know, the key would be now all has been heard. Here is the conclusion of the matter. Fear God and keep his commandments, for this is the duty of all mankind. So even though, you know, after all this time this morning, if there's anything that you were to remember, 
then this is it. This is, you know, the summary, the conclusion, you know, of, uh, of the message. 敬畏呢,唔係得口講嘅,係有行動,點樣表達呢,就係遵行聖經嘅教導。So fearing God is not just uh, lip service, you know, there is actions attached to it, you know, which here it says, you know, keeping God's commandments. 求神幫助我哋愛神,敬畏神。so we pray to God that you know, we continue to love and fear God. So we're going to use the following hymn as our response. <laughs> 